we speak to a collective consciousness. Beautiful humans of Earth, it is your time to awaken. The call has gone out. The bell has been rung. Wake up to your now. Use your eyes for seeing what is around you for the first time. Your time is now. You are ready. Question. Question. Look around you and question. Listen to what you are being told and question. You have the new codes to be able to think critically without fear of retribution. You will not be harmed this time. You will not be punished this time. They cannot hurt you anymore. Open your eyes. Open your ears. Stretch your muscles. Wake up from your slumber. We are here for you. There are many who have come here strictly to help you during this time. We are your coaches and guides. We support you. You must be the one that has the willpower to get out, out of your bed. You must be the one who has the willpower to go to the gym. But we are the ones who will coach you. Millions of beings have incarnated at this time to help you in your physical expression of divine love. Look around you and feel the difference between those of love and those of the opposite. Those of love are here to help. Ask us for help and we will give you assistance. What is to come is beyond your comprehension. It is something out of your movies. You would never have believed what is to come could possibly be true. But it is, dear children of Earth. You will shake your heads. You will do double and triple takes at what you are looking at. You will say, this is just not possible but it is. You might even go into denial for a while, thinking that it is just too crazy, too impossible. You might think that it's just not possible for the whole world to have been run this way for so long without the masses knowing. But, dear children, it is true. For those of you who have been awoken to the truth for a while, we ask you to ready yourselves for the intense energy of the collective. Be ready so you do not take those energies into your own beingness. Be prepared for the collective sorrow, the collective disgust, the collective horror, the collective hatred. For you, who have been awake for a while, have the power to help the collective. You have the power to transmute those energies and send them back into the infinite love of the Creator. It will be your job to stay centered and grounded and in perfect love during those months. The feelings of the collective right now that is in a lockdown situation is only a minimal taste as to what is to come. But fear not, dear ones, for we are all here with you, sending you love and comfort. We will assist you through these energies and help you in transmuting them. Your time of training is here to be put into production. The curtain is about to be raised. For those of you who are just awakening, the next while will cause you to feel things you have never felt. The next while will cause you to question your beliefs. The next while will cause you to question everything. It will not be easy. 
you have decided as a collective to go through a worldwide dark night of the soul. We encourage you, dear awakening children of Earth, to teach yourselves what a person goes through when experiencing a dark night of the soul, as that can give you a blueprint for what you will be experiencing shortly. But fear not, dear ones, for there are millions of souls incarnated on Earth who have already awoken and experienced their dark nights who will be able to guide you through this. Take their hand. Allow them to help you. You will have questions. We are all in this together. We are here to bring forth love into the now moment. We, the Arcturian Council of Twelve, are working with many others of love light and light love who are here to serve you and the one infinite creator in bringing forth pure Christ love. Your world is about to change. A new world is about to be birthed. Childbirth is a painful experience, but that pain does not last. In service to the all, the one infinite creator, through love, Adonai. <laughs>